Strength training is really important in the menopause and it's something I've been telling my clients over the, the last few years, even more so than ever with osteoporosis, you know, that is definitely one of the symptoms that you can get, you know, from losing all the oestrogen. So I would say to you guys, you don't have to go to the gym and, you know, obviously if you've got the, the, the time or the luxury to go to a gym, great. Find a great person there that can help you through a strength training program. However, we want to try and use stuff that's within our daily, everyday life, daily input. So for me, going shopping, I've got my two shopping bags here, these here, evenly weighed out, walking home with these. And you'll be surprised, you know, walking a mile with these bags, it's strength training and it's within your, your control as well. Over there to my right, I've got my, my gym equipment there, my kettlebells. Some of you may already use them, but that's okay. If you don't have them, don't feel bad about that. Another one that I've often said, and we underestimate this, what's within our household, getting in and out of a chair. 10 times doing this, keep your arms out in front of you, hands down by your side, arms out in front, to your side. Repeat that, you're using your quads all the time, getting in and out of the chair, and you're using your body weight. One more thing, if you want to go a little bit more advanced. Standing, I'm just going to show you on this angle so you can see, into a squat position, into a lunge, into a squat, into a lunge, into a squat, into a lunge, into a squat, into a lunge. And again, you can do that for 30 seconds. Three, sec three sets of those, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. Remember, use what's within your control, in your environment, what works for you.